It felt like there were girls in this particular community that were underserved at other schools or other places and they wanted to provide that service for them to make sure that even the girls in this community that may not have uh, the best of everything, but have the opportunity to go to college just as anyone else. So I think the dream was is to not only help girls in some after school program to rebuild their academics, but what if you could do that all day, every day, then you would have an impact uh, not only on the girls, but on their communities, on their lives and on their communities. So in July of 2009, the Chattanooga Girls Leadership Academy opened its doors to the first group of girls that would see the benefit of that impact. And with each year that passes, the school and its students continue to grow side by side. I think that one of the things that, that, that's really important in building the school is building a community from the inside out. And what I mean by that is we start with ourselves. We start with the faculty and the staff and make a commitment that we are a community, that we are a team on the inside of the building. And the girls are part of our team. That push towards excellence resonates throughout the halls of CGLA. But what's being built here isn't only success in the classroom. Every day, these girls are learning to dream and to imagine endless possibilities for their futures. She wants to go to college, and that's something she's never talked about. They do a lot of career activities here uh, because it is, it may be far in the future for her, but it's, it's closer than she think it is. So she's beginning to talk about it because they're beginning to talk to her about it. She loves science. Uh, she wasn't that good in math, but uh, her math scores have really, really uh, jumped since she's, she's been here. She can really see where science and, and math can take her, and it's really piqued her interest more. By being a STEM school, it helped out because it opened a lot of doors that I didn't really know that I wanted to be open or I didn't want to pursue. So now going off to college, I'll be a therapist. So that STEM background really did help me a lot. Within these walls, Preparing girls for college isn't just about building strong academics. It's about building a sense of community, a family. And together, with the support of their peers and mentors, they develop confidence, self-esteem, and leadership skills that will benefit them throughout their lives. You can say the square root of this is equal to the square root of this. The teachers really connect with students on all levels to figure out, okay, what do you need today? to be successful. Because what you needed yesterday may not be the same thing you need today. You may come in with different circumstances. You know, we have students who come in with some hardships that, you know, as, as kids, some of our teachers may not have grown up with. I feel like one of my biggest roles at this school is to be a cheerleader um, because a lot of these students haven't haven't had someone saying yes you can, yes you can, and then celebrating with them when they have these successes, whether they be personal, academic. They all know you like personally, like they know your challenges, your struggles and how good you are at something. And if you need help, they come and help you right away if you need it. There is no such thing as not participating here because by it being so little girls, the teachers are always there. They're always hands-on. If you need help, you don't have to wait till after class to get it. You get it right then and there. You don't have to really worry about, worry about what people think is like, as far as asking questions. They pride and they push you to ask questions because whatever you don't know, somebody else may not know the same thing. And that's one of their mottos. And that push to question, to learn and to lead, doesn't end when class is over. The SunTrust Youth Bank gives CGLA students the opportunity to learn how to manage a bank account while offering others the chance to develop job skills that will help prepare them for what lies ahead. The LEGO Robotics team puts engineering and technology into action as students build and program robots to compete in statewide competitions. And the Mustang Leadership Partners give CGLA girls the chance to experience learning in a truly unique classroom taught by a very unconventional teacher. 
it's been really amazing to see their leadership grow and uh, the teamwork grow as they all work together and their confidence most of all. Just seeing them come out here all very timid at first and to see them over the years just progress so it's really it's amazing to see the progress that they make. That progress is evident in the eyes of every student at Chattanooga Girls Leadership Academy. I walk around to the classrooms and I see uh, engaged girls. I see different types of teaching strategies going on in the building. I see uh, projects taking place not only inside the classroom, uh, but there's a lot of teaching that goes on outside the classroom. And so uh, all of that's coming together and I think it's wonderful to uh, start to see girls with that look in their eye. You can tell. I feel like I came a long way. I feel like this school, it played a big part in progressing me to where I need to go. I feel like me coming here was a life experience. You know, our goal and our dream uh, is to build it and to make it stronger and bigger and better, but at the end of the day, have always made it good uh, and a great place for girls to have gotten a start. With academic proficiency increasing each year, the community that's been built here is filled with big dreams and endless possibilities for a bright future.